Um, rounding the bend towards 30, uh, lieutenant in the Sea Cadet Corps. Uh, I don't know. I, I couldn't have believed it. I would like to believe it, but I don't know if I could have believed it. You, you couldn't even begin to understand what it took just to put the ceremony together. <laughs> and I'm starting to learn what it took for uh, Lieutenant Commander Gallagher to take care of this unit and to grow this unit and bring it to what it is today to a point where I don't even have to do anything. I'm stepping into a ship that's already pointed in the right direction and firing on all four cylinders, or however many cylinders a ship of this size would have. Likely more, but it's, uh, it's one heck of a ship. It's something to be proud of. Uh, we got the greatest staff. We've got the greatest cadets. Uh, people we ask regularly, ask a lot of, and uh, they never fail, ever. Uh, guys, you can call in uh, for my wardroom staff on a weeknight over the summer, and they'll be there in an hour. Cadets that'll, you know, stay up late and get all their sea cadet work done and make sure to bring it in the next day if that's what you need, or go to a, a change of command ceremony or a decommissioning ceremony. And not only do they do these things, the, the wardroom staff and the cadets alike, they do them in such a manner that we get nothing but accolades every time from the highest levels, from admirals in the Navy. Uh, people that don't need to recognize that a sea cadet was even present and make it a point to let us know that they looked so good that they blended right in with the sailors. Um, all of this really has become so easy because of uh, Mr. Gallagher. Uh, I can't thank him enough. I've tried many times, especially over this process. As all the files started migrating from his office to mine, all the accounts started getting switched over, uh, all the pass downs started occurring, and uh, it seemed to go on forever. There's a lot to it, a lot more to it than I originally knew, ever would have guessed. Uh, but he has done such an outstanding job with it, he's made it easy for me. Uh, I am here because of what he's done for me. Because Mr. Gallagher could not be considered simply a good sea cadet officer, uh, or simply a good commanding officer. He's also been a great friend. And I know Top Hatters is sad to see him go, but we're going to be really glad um, to have him up at the regional staff. If he can do, for this region, 10% of what he did for Top Hatter Squadron, the, uh, the sea cadets has a really great future. So, in response to one of my cadets' questions from last night, are you going to change a lot of stuff, sir? Uh, <laughs> no, I'm not. I don't see a reason to. Like I said, the ship is heading in the right direction. We're going to keep it going that way. Uh, so.